Welcome to Orange Labs. Orange Labs is a secret laboratory located deep in the bowels of the Celestron compound. Here we test all the devices sent down from the mothership to see how well they really work. Oh, what are you working on? Oh, hello, Y. Oh, hello. I was just about to explore my latest discovery, the electronic digital microscope from Celestron. It allows you to see all kinds of things, like this ant here. It's fabulous. It's stupendous. It's... Why don't you just tell them about the microscope? So this amazing gizmo plugs directly into your computer and allows you to view all kinds of things right on the screen. It's got this great stand that allows me to position it in all kinds of different ways. It's connected via this nifty universal serial bus connector. You mean USB port, right? That's what I think I said. Okay. A USB. You can take pictures of ants, dirt, mushrooms, and fungi, and all kinds of things. It allows me to take pictures and make measurements. We can even do science. So it's like a webcam that magnifies things? Yes, exactly like that. Can you imagine all the things we could take pictures of with this? Why, we could take pictures of bacteria, microorganisms, and spiders, and ants, and tomatoes, and... It has a 1.3 megapixel camera. Wow, I would be the envy of the entire science community with this. And it has three different magnifications, 10, 40, and 150 power. Wow, with that I can view things of all kinds of different scales. Pretty amazing, huh? This is really fun. I bet I could look at some other fun stuff, too. Why don't we look to see if we can find some things? Well, I think I have some dirt that I knocked off my shoe this morning. Wonder what that looks like under this. Wow. wow! Look at the tiny crystal. Ooh, what is that huge thing? Looks like a leaf. A leaf? But a leaf is a little tiny thing. This is huge. I can't wait to get this on my Facebook page. If there were insects crawling around in there, we could use the record video button to actually record them as they walked around on the screen. It actually takes video? Yep. Why don't we try the spider? Ooh, that sounds scary. Wow, he's even bigger. Look at this. With the nifty measuring software that comes with this microscope, I can even do little measurements. Let's see how far his eyes are apart. That's amazing. Look at the size of those legs. You can see all the hairs and tendrils. Let's see how easy it is to take a picture. All I have to do is press this big orange button. Just like that. And now we have a picture. And it saves it right onto your hard drive. Amazing. Yep. Let's try something else. Why don't we try the shell? Okay. I'll have to take it out of the stand and put it on the shell. Doesn't it look like gills? It does look like gills. This reminds me of something I had at Red Lobster yesterday. Let's check out this mushroom that I didn't eat for lunch. Neato Jetcopter. Wow, look at that. Look at that. You can see little membranes. I wonder what that part of the mushroom does. I'm not sure. But I bet it tastes good. It looked better on my dinner plate. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. The rind of the lime is the outer portion of the lime, the part of the lime that you don't eat. It looks really juicy, folks. It does. Let's try some other household items, like a penny. Oh, that's a good one. All right. Wow. Even at low power, Abraham takes up the entire screen. He sure does. But I bet I know something that you don't know, Professor. Oh, what's that? Why? There's another Abraham Lincoln on the other side, too. Really? Why don't I show you? I see the Lincoln Memorial. He's right there. Wow! Sitting on the center. Did you know that? I knew there was an Abraham Lincoln in the memorial, but I didn't know that it was actually replicated in the penny. Yep. Wow. It's not counterfeit. A $20 bill. There's some microtext on some of these. There we go. There's virtually an unlimited number of things you could look at with this. And you can put it right on the stand and also see it at 40. Wow. 40 power. So let's go through the features again. It's got 10, 
40 and 150 magnification, a built-in LED to illuminate your samples, and it's got photo management software. It takes 1.3 megapixel pictures and it takes video. Plugs right into your computer using a USB port. And that means it doesn't need batteries. Even perfect. Ah. I gotta say, I think this passes the orange lab test. I agree. For those of you watching at home, this would be a great holiday gift for any Jane scientist or Johnny engineer growing up in your household. And they can grow up and become scientists and join Y and myself and do science. <laughs> I agree with you, Professor. So go out and get yours today.